Welcome to Gord Field in Detroit Rock, Michigan. Nice town, isn't it, Bricks? Well, by nice, you mean a town that would welcome you by cold cocking in the head with a vacuum cleaner and stealing your luggage in the middle of a motel check-in and throwing you off the bridge into a polluted lake while enjoying your morning walk to the stadium? Then yes, Grim, very nice town. Couldn't be lovelier. The teams are juiced up and ready for blood as they take the field for NFL action. The Nashville Lycans take on the Motor City Maniacs. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Grim Blitzrow with you along with my partner, former player Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. And his life partner, the mini mutant head that lives on his shoulder, Bricks Jr. Hey, you just threw up on my shoulder. I don't often drink beer, but when I do, I get totally shit-faced. I am the world's most intoxicated man. Say that again. <laughs> First and ten. You can't keep a good meal. And the running game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. are scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a murderer! And it's first and ten. Full man about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. for a couple of yards. Third and two. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. First down and nine. Second down and a lot. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! And they line up for the extra point. It's good. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Man, what a hit that was. And it's first and ten. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Second and three. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's 
First and ten. And then Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. He picks up nine yards on that catch. And that'll bring up second and one. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of butter. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. up two yards on the pass. Then this guy's six feet tall. He could just have fallen over and gotten two yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. They run it for a yard. And that'll bring up third down and seven. for a first down. And it's first and ten. He refuses to go down. Pow! With the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. one we're all tied up we'll be right back second down and ain't gonna happen partner and he held on to that one for a first down <laughs> First down and seven. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. And I think he's warming down his guy to the speed feed grip. He's running from his team, it's clear. Now there are some who 
would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sick. The kick is good! Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection, too. Uh, now that has weird side effects, Bricks. First and ten. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Second down and two. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Third and two. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> that gets me every time. Like a jack in a box, Bricks. You never know when one of those hot potatoes is going to blow. You just crap your pants, Junior. And it's first and ten. QB might as well just bury himself now. And, oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. Second down and ten. A lot of singles as he runs off the field. How do you think he got those, Grim? Didn't you see him stripping on the sidelines? He's primed, you idiot. I won't even get out of Second down and long. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And he breaks away. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And that's the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? Find out next time on NFL Game Day. Uh, it's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. And it's 
first and ten. I'm surprised no one uses the Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. Two minutes remain in the half. Great! I gotta take a dump! Again? You just went. How is that even possible? Ah, it's the nachos, man! Want some? And nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. He could go all the way. And they're catching up. Joke, job, don't stop it. First and ten. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Second down and ten. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stomped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the old... And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. <laughs> oh, and the defender cut off that pass like a suburban mom on the way to speak to the... Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when you're not young. First and ten. Kaboom! And the quarterback unleashes a sonic blast against the defense, knocking everyone down but his receiver. They knocked them right on their asses! <laughs> oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. For a kick this far, you just got to kick it as hard as you can, partner. And aim. It's really important from this distance. It's probably a smart idea. Well, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and, uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep, third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Welcome back. Hope you enjoyed the carnage during today's halftime show. 
Obviously, they need to play a lot harder here in the second half to make a game of it. Or they can start cheating and killing. That's what I do. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! for a yard. Second down and nine. He's got his beast boost working. The player just transformed into a violent form of pure badass. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You got to keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You got to make that catch. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. And he snags the punt and looks for open. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Second down and ten. They go to the ground game and pick up the first. Nicely done. And it's first and ten. Oh, with a punishing hit, the quarterback goes down. <laughs> here or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room the kick is good as expected those are pretty much just gimmies the best kind of kick is 
happens when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. And the QB might as well just bury himself now because this guy's full on berserk. Oh, at least he could suck. Oh, man. Brooks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Hey, man. And it's first and ten. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. Second down and a lot. That ball was almost intercepted. Third down and the punter is warming up. And they're picking up chunks of yards now. Nice reception for 10 yards. Man, these guys have metal balls. They're going to try to pick up the first down here. Do they jingle when they run? They clank you. And chainsaws really have a way of extending the red zone on account of all that blood. <laughs> the defense must have called a hot potato dirty trick. That'll wake you up and then put you to sleep permanently. You snooze, you lose. Unless you're in a sleeping contest. And it's first and ten. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and ten. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Third down and, nope, good luck. third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. I got the thing stuck in my ear again! And he booted a high arcing rainbow. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. It's first and ten. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. And he 
put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. They want more points, so they're going for two. here and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. Perfect kick and recovery by the kicking team. And it's first and ten. for a first down. First and four. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any quarterback passes for a touchdown. Try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? they just be called The kick is good! Eh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and, uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. And he picks up eight yards on a strong run. Second down and two. Finds an opening and the first down. Mm. And 
and it's first and ten. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Pick up of about three on that play. Second down and seven. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grin. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. First and ten. And he picks up ten on that run. Man, he nearly broke that one open, Bricks. Yeah, and I nearly married Trim Big Assian. And I nearly did not crap my pants earlier. Nearly as... And then will bring us to the two-minute warning. It's do or die now. Second down the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. And he breaks through for a touchdown! Listen to this crowd! Hey, get you a rep. It's not murder if you have a cover, right? Take the hit, do something about that rep, you pussies! <laughs> Second down and ten. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stupsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. <laughs> Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Oh, and that kick to his highlight reel. That was perfect. And since he's a kicker, that brings him up to a one-hole highlight. And it's first and ten. And this guy runs angry and runs hard. First down. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. And it's first and ten. Defense holds him to a four yard pick up there. They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Ah, that's okay, Grim. They can have mine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. It's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult it. The quarterback burns his last time out. He can't stop the clock anymore. And it's first and ten. Oh, with the punishing hit. First and four. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown! Touchdown! Yeah. 
point attempt. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Oh, he's going berserk. The ball carrier. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. The offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. That's right, folks. It's all tied up, and we are headed to overtime. I don't know how many players are left alive, but the rest are headed to sudden death. They should call this game Mutant Death League. Breaks overtime is a war with some basic rules. The first touchdown wins the game, but if the team that receives the kickoff gets a field goal, then the other team is allowed a possession too. After that, whomever scores wins. Here comes the kickoff. And it's first and ten. Up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Oh, what a brutal hit! And that'll bring up second and one. the way a rolled up dollar bill sticking out of flimsy Lohan's nose. It's a mare in Lost Wages, Nevada. And it's first and ten. <laughs> and like Bricks' his bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. <laughs> First down and five. Yeah, that was beautiful. 
Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...